It's now time for Trivia Tracks with yours truly, Price Robertson. This edition of Trivia Tracks is brought to you by ProMed Ambulance Services, care you can count on, and Beth Smith at Edward Jones. Edward Jones, making sense of investing, member SIPC. Does the name Andre Rene Rusimov sound familiar? Well, it doesn't with a lot of people, but those of you who love wrestling will know him best as Andre the Giant. Born in France in 1946, Andre, the son of a Bulgarian father and Polish mother, weighed 13 pounds at birth. As a child, he displayed symptoms of gigantism and was noted as a good head taller than other kids with abnormally long hands. He stated in one interview that his mother was 5 foot 2 and his father 6 foot 2. According to his father, his grandfather was 7 foot 8. By the time he was 12, Andre stood 6 feet 3 inches. Though an average student, he was good at mathematics. After years working on the family farm, Andre decided to take up wrestling. Beginning his career in 1966, Rusimov, who by this time had become 7 feet 4 inches, relocated to North America in 1971 working for the AWA under Vern Gagne. In 1973, he joined the WWWF, where promoter Vince McMahon Sr. used him as a roving special attraction. He worked as a babyface early in his American wrestling career. During the 1980s wrestling boom, Andre the Giant, who came to be called the eighth wonder of the world, became a mainstay of the WWWF, by then renamed the World Wrestling Federation, turned heel over time teamed up with manager Bobby the Brain Heenan, and feuded with Hulk Hogan. The two headlined WrestleMania III in 1987, and in 1988, Andre defeated Hogan to win his sole World Heavyweight Championship, which led to what some fans consider one of the greatest angles of all time. When Ted DiBiase attempted to buy Andre's championship title, this was five years after a similar angle occurred in one of the Southern promotions where Killer Tim Brooks sold his championship title to Larry Zbysko after defeating Paul Orndorff. As his WWF career wound down after WrestleMania VI in 1990, Andre the Giant wrestled primarily in Japan. Outside of wrestling, he found some acting roles, including appearing as Fezzik the Giant in the 1987 film The Princess Bride, and years before that, a guest role as Bigfoot on TV's The Six Million Dollar Man. On the morning of January 28, 1993, Andre the Giant died of congestive heart failure in his sleep at a Paris hotel room. He was 46 years old. Another factor in his poor health was his affliction with acromegaly, where the pituitary gland produces too much growth hormone. After his death, Andre the Giant became the inaugural inductee into the newly created WWF Hall of Fame. He was later a charter member of the Wrestling Observer Newsletter and Professional Wrestling Halls of Fame. Till next time, I'm Price Robertson. Amazed by today's trivia? Then join me for Trivia Tracks weekdays at 645 on Everybody's Country Y95.